if we are conserving what brace will you apply because most common area of the fracture is d11 d12 l1 those areas in these type what type of brace do you apply in my experience the that hash brace which i used to give earlier most of the patients just discard it or the tailor's yeah. brace also some people are not ready to accept so what would you like to apply for that so uh, bracing in osteoporotic fractures is a controversy in itself many there is a lot of literature on that and many uh, authors believe and many surgeons believe that don't give bracing it just compromises them they don't wear it it compromises their chest they are uncomfortable with it it's not easy to get in and some people believe that no it helps in that so i think for a patient who is otherwise lean thin and can accept a brace i uh, it's unconventional but i feel that they tolerate tailor's brace better although it does not prevent flexion but it just gives them that comfort to move around and you tell them purposely don't bend if the patient can tolerate the ash brace then nothing like it because it's the one which is logically more uh, uh, sort of you know orthopedically which is more relevant it prevents the flexion and it keeps the patient upright but again tolerability is a big issue